hey guys, Streamcast Jin here, welcome back to more Paper Mario. In the last episode, we showed all the little secrets in Paper Mario, up to now at least. And we really don't have much else. After defeating all all the main bosses and getting all the star spirits, we really are just doing all the side quests. Basically this is just a roundup before we head off to chapter 8. Anyway, um, this episode, we want to go to, um, Koopa Village, because there is something for us now that we have everything accessible to us. You just want to go in this one house right here. And let me tell you, this guy right here, he's another set of he- he has another set of he- of- Okay. He is the start of a really long side quest as well. Not as long as the mailing one, but just, it's pretty long, so... Today we're gonna do that. Oh, welcome, young fella. I'm the elder of Koopa Village. Folks call me Koopa Koop. Say, might you do me a favor? Sure, why not? Oh, how very kind of you. I guess the younger generation isn't so bad after all. Wait, you had, like, plans against me? Or at least, no, 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 I get, I get what he means. Well then, young fella, I don't usually ask for favors, but... Perhaps just one little one. Did you borrow the book Koopa Legends from Colorado? Uh, we're borrowing a book from that guy. I'm certain if you were to ask Colorado why he'd lend it. If it isn't a trouble, please go through as soon as possible. You may, you promise, young fella. Yeah, so these side quests are little short ones, and sometimes they can be longer. Oh uh, yeah, he just says the same stuff. I don't even know why I talk to him. So just talk to her about the whole book thing. Oh, do you need something? Do you do an errand for the Elder, are you? Hmm, right. Koopa Legends. Yes, my husband owns that one. Of course you can borrow it. Don't let that old Koopa Coop work. Don't let that old Koop work you too hard, okay, Mario? He knows to do that. He's known to do that. He also has a bit short-tempered. Hmm, that's nice. Well, anyway, wait here for just a moment. I'll go poke around my husband's bookshelf. You know, you wouldn't, you, know, you wouldn't talk about this with them first. I mean, he's literally watching all this. Found it. You were talking about this book, right? It's all yours. Again, he's literally just watching this happen. It was behind the bookshelf. <laughs> How convenient. Okay. The Koopa Legends. The Colorado Strange Book. Deliver it to this Koopa. To Koopa Koop. It's strange, that book. It has all these pictures of shells and exercise. Remember, remember shells in 30 days. What the heck is an old man want with this book? Oh, uh, whatever. Hey, old man, we got your diet book for you. Great, God and good buzz. You are a lifesaver, Mario. You're welcome. This is just what I need. <laughs> okay, you're creepy. Show you my gratitude. I'd like to make a gift of this. Oh, you don't have to be so polite, young fella. Take this. We got a coin. Yeah. Oh, what luck you. Ah, perfect timing, young man. Could you see your way of doing me another favor? Fine. Can you see where this is gonna lead off now? Oh, how very kind of you. I guess the younger. Okay, he just says the same thing again. Okay. Lately, I've been sleeping poorly. I'd love a sleepy sheep to help me catch a little shut eye. There should be a shop in Toad Town that sells them. If it isn't a bother, hurry up and get one, alright? You promised, young fella. Yep. So, it's to Toad Town. Okay, we're here, and you really have to have some money to do this side quest. I mean, 
50 coins should help you. And my inventory's full. Um, but I'll let him keep the snowman doll. I'm not letting him keep any of my my good items because I have that incident. Here, have my snowman doll. You know what? I just thought. So when you have that snowman doll with you, is it like a little, you know, snowman doll, like an actual toy doll? Well, then when you use it, it comes to real life and makes everything snowy. Because if that is true, I want, I want one of those. In fact, someone try and find me a snowman doll, like plush or whatever. And I just want to like, I just want to just anyone send me a snowman doll. That's all. Okay, we're back, and here's your thing that's supposed to help you get knocked out. My star is your venerable hero, Mario. Welcome again. Finally, some peace and quiet, sweet dreams. Here I come. <laughs> you know what? He always does that hee 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 part, so he's gonna creep someone out. Take this as a small thank you. Better not be a coin again. Okay, yeah. Yep. Alright, cool. Oh, I know. I just skipped some important text. Anyway, um, we got the silver credit. It was just a basic. He was just basically talking about how Toad Town Playroom, the silver credit card, the silver credit, not card. Yeah, the silver credit will just let you play mini games and earn coins. A card Coop Coop gave you, use it to play in the playroom. We'll get on, we'll get to that later. Okay, um. I don't suppose you go to Goomba Village and find Goomba, the grandfather. He still has a tape I lent him well, a while back. Could you get it for me? I really want it. If you say, the tape, he'll know what you're talking about. <laughs> you know, he'll have suspicions first. He'll be like, where'd you learn about this? Try to keep this whole thing under wraps. Would you, would you promise, young fella? Okay, I'm not even cutting. I'm not even cutting this one. It's just simple. Just go to a pipe. And just go. No, here. So you go to that. You go from this pipe to that one. And the access is really easy. You know what? I want to know how the piping works in this world because literally there must be like long roots of metal somewhere around the whole area. Even out of here. Oh wait, never mind. Hmm, Mario, it looks like something else is on your mind. What? Koopa Koot says he wants the tape back. Bad old Koopa. How does he remember things from so, from a long ago? What the heck? I mean, what the heck, dude? Is this, like, from five years ago or something? Okay, wait just a minute. I'll bring it out for you. So... By the end of all this... Wait... The tape's behind the chair? I went behind that chair once, so how come I didn't get it? Here, this is it. When you see the old Koopa, give him my regrets. You got the tape. A tape returned by Goomba. Deliver it to Koopa. Koopa good. Although, this does bring up a question. There's no TVs in the area, so... How do they have- how can they play that tape now, unless it's like on a tape recorder, but, I don't know. What's that? You want to know what's on the tape, do you? Yes, actually I want to know. Oh, no, 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 I'm sorry, I'm afraid I cannot tell you at the moment- Come on, quit holding back! It was great, though. Yeah, that's all we need to know. If anything, this whole cyclist is just gonna make the, um, Koopa Koop look all the more suspicious. Yeah. Alright, here's your tape that we somehow didn't get to know about. Oh, okay, there's a radio in the back of this house, so I can see how you play it. Sup, friend? Shaw, guys. Mario, you're a real gent. Didn't Koopa complain? Yeah, kind of. 
take this as a gesture of my eternal gratitude. It, it watch, just gave me another coin. Just watch. Oh, you don't have to, okay? See, I'm such a good one. We should get some real payment. Okay, next favor. We're here to do them all. Alright. I've got a hankering for some cup of tea. It's the very best. Fetch a bit for me, would you? Cup of tea can be made only with a fresh cup of tea, which you can find in the village. Grilling it requires a special technique. Only a current, um, Kirtland, Kir, I don't even know, master can make this tea the proper way, so that it works with flavor. You know, I think young Miss Taste Tea of Toad Town is quite a tea brew master. You mean basically go get a leaf, show it to her that we found something from the ground, tell her, I want you to cook this one leaf and make it into a liquid. Do it. <laughs> what do you say? You run along and bring me back some piping hot. I have your word, young fella. Again, you could be like gone forever. And come back and just say, oh yeah, I totally, um, like, you can be gone forever, right? And then the minute you have, you still have it in your inventory, it's still considered piping hot. You could even go to Shiver City and, like, you expect it to get all cold, but no, it's still gonna be all hot. It's still gonna be, like, you know, nice and warm. So, yeah, consistency, I find it. I'll see you all in Toad Town. Alright, Tasty, we're back. Alright, here's the coop belief. I want you to turn this solid item into a liquid. No, I don't want you to use- I don't want any other ingredients. Just turn this one solid item into a liquid. Uh... Here you are. Okay, a little note is, in the first game, it's blue. In the second game, the cup's green. Yes, I know. I know all this. And also, I, I do believe in the second game, it got buffed down, so, eh. We got Koopa Tea. And, like, it's not even... It, it's not... The cup's not even green, so, like, how can you... Did you just, like... Nah, I don't even want to know anymore. I don't even want to know. It's just... I'll meet y'all in Koopa Village. Here's your tea, enjoy! It's still hot. Great growing gulp. It's your definitely comparison, Mario. Wonderful. Oh, excellent. Mmm, this hits the spot. You know, this tea is just as delicious ice as it is hot. Okay! You're a stand-up guy for doing an old Koopa so many favors. This time, I'll give you this special gift of the banks. Don't tell anybody, though. I got a reputation, Keep. You have a reputation at your age? I thought you hit retirement. Anyway, we got three star pieces. Nice. Okay, so he's not holding back on us anymore. So those three coins were just flukes. Oh, um, wait. Okay, here we go. I have a secret wish to get the great Luigi's autograph. He's your brother, right? Yeah, he's my brother. That young fella is true is truly super. You have seen him jump. They should call him Air Luigi. If you could somehow get his autograph, I'd be really happy. Could you help a young Okay, fine. And you're not even young. You're like on retirement. And again, that's not something I should be saying. When we to the Ouija! Okay, and we are back home. And I got so lucky this time because Luigi Luigi can be in random areas throughout the house. Well, throughout the house of the area. And I got lucky because last time he was literally on a block. I, yeah, I tried doing this side quest like before chapter 7, but then I decided against it. But yeah, last time he was on this block, 
that I couldn't reach, and I had to have the super jump in order for it to, um, I mean, tornado jump to reach him. So, eh, whatever. Princess Peach is still caught way up in the sky. Come on, Mario. You're a hero, bro. You had to save her. You try doing what I do. What's that, Mario? You need something? Yeah, for once, I actually need you to do something. You what, Mr. Koopa Koop wants you to get my autograph? Me? He wants me to sign something? Yeah, sign this piece of paper that it doesn't even matter. Well, cool. I'm flattered. I guess maybe I'm a little bit of a celebrity, huh? Uh, no, I could yes, maybe. Well, that didn't turn out well. Wait one second. I'll write it right now. You literally need to turn away from us to write an autograph. Here we are, Mario. My autograph. Give my regrets to Mr. Koopa, Koop, okay? And we got an autograph with green Luigi. Luigi's autograph. Koopa Koop wants this for some odd reason. Um, a little um secret I am um, also forgot to show off was when you go off in, when you go into Mario's house, you got all this. It's basically a what was I gonna say? Like results in a way. It shows how many badges there are in the game. There are 80 badges, which I'm only halfway there. Um, star pieces, which again, I'm kind of close. Not even close, actually. Tasty's recipes, there's 50. Chuck Quizmo quizzes. Which. 7 out of 7? Oh no! We just did Chuck Quizmo's last quiz in the last. Oh! Chuck Quizmo. Okay, yeah, um, anyway. Number of battles, um... Yeah, and then you show your, your first strikes, enemies first strike you, total power balance is, yeah, 22, I can do better than that. And then I believe, down here is something we will deal with later. So yeah, that was the last of Chuck Quizmo in the last episode. I can't believe I didn't notice that in a way. <laughs> oh, and then I also remembered, I sc so that means I also screwed up as well, because the uh, um, one video I didn't show you guys about Luigi being on that gigantic block was I talked about the um, results, and I somehow said there are 53 Chug Quizmo questions, and yet there are just 7, so how did I screw that up? I don't, I don't know, nor do I care. Must have been looking at something wrong. Okay, we're back. Here's your autograph from Ouija. Hoppin' Hammer Bros, you're a wizard. <gasps> you're a wizard, Mario. Oh, I love that line. I have so many unique treasures now. What a lucky Koopa am I. Here, take this and know that I'm very grateful. We got... A Dude, where's the good prizes? Where are they? You you hand them out, you show them, you give me the good prizes. Alright, next favor. The other day I went shopping at Koopa Shop in this village. On the way home I must have dropped my wallet on the road. How am I supposed to find that? Look for it, would you? My memory is kind of sketchy, but I... I remember talking to the guy who listens to the radio in front of his house. I'm sure my wallet was with me then, but I, after I got home, I realized it was gone. That's not really much of a hint, you know. I'm hyperventilating. Dude, if you're hyperventilating right now, you must you must have died. I must be, find that wallet. Promise you'll help me. Okay. Let's just talk to you. Nope, you're not helpful. Um, guy listens to music. Actually, wait. Oh, it's him. Oh, I remember this guy. We, t we talked to him once. When the fuzz was around.
wait a minute, what? Okay, don't get me wrong, we all just saw there were seven Chuck Quizmo quizzes, and now he's back? Co-Wiz, it's everyone's favorite quiz master, Chuck Quizmo! Wanna try the quiz? Yes! Okay! You know what, I'm gonna look up the... Once this video's over, I'm gonna look up the amount of questions you get in this game. So yeah, question A. What color are the Ouija's pants? Okay, this isn't hard. I mean, we didn't just see him five seconds ago and- WHY?! I didn't- No! What is- <laughs> Oops! Tough luck, pal! Wrong answer. I can't believe this! Better luck next time. He looks so sad! <laughs> I actually failed for once. Okay, yeah. Um, I believe you just gotta check the bushes. Oh, yep, found it. You got the empty wallet. A wallet can be coop drop. Return it home. Yeah, it looks like someone robbed him. Yeah. That's great. Literally. I failed, Chuck Quizmo. Why did I even choose green? I, I was thinking this hat. Here's your empty wallet that somehow's robbed. Oh, thanks, Star Haven. You saved me again, Mario. Yeah. I'm really having some suspicions on these chores he's giving us. You seem to have a nose for finding things. Take this as a thanks. Don't let it be another coin. I hate you. I'm really starting to wonder if we're doing this guy's... If we're actually doing this guy's favors, or if we're just doing his chores for a living. Okay. If you find the time, I really... I really do have a craving for a tasty tonic. Most shops sell it. It's my all-time favorite drink, and I thought tea was your favorite. It really clears out the old, um, beak. Yes, indeed. Those are beaks? Fetch me a cold one, would you? I'm parched over here. I ha have your word, young fella. Okay, I know exactly what to do. I think they even sell them in this town. If not, then... Epic cutting. But, we're checking. Ugh. Time to epic cut! Okay, here we go. Tasty tonic. Very... whatever. Alright, now that we bought this guy's tasty tonic, he said he wants a cold. Or at least, just ice cold. Just cold in a way, okay? Said he wants it cold? I'll let him have it cold, alright? <sighs> alright, should be cold enough. All right, let's head back to town. You don't re you actually didn't really have to do that. I just did it for fun. All right, here's your really cold thing. Our own piranhas. You're like a psychic Mario. Uh -huh. This is exactly what I wanted. As gratitude of my as as a gesture of my gratitude and generosity, take this. Better not be a coin again. Why can't I hate this guy. Alright, I think this will be the last one we do, and then we'll end the episode off. Alright, he wants us to... I've heard that through the grapevine that there's a beautiful fortune teller living on shooting star sides. So, if you would... I want you to hike up there and ask her for an autograph. I'm too shot in, I'm too old, I'm in retirement. Run along for me now, I can barely wait. You promised to hurry. 
Ugh. That's... I'm, I'm starting to wonder if we're doing this guy's chores. Okay, here we are. Hey, you. Yeah, you. We need your autograph. Excuse me? You want... My autograph. Yeah, I'm as confused as you are. My, my, mercy. Are you sure it's mine you want? Yes, I'm pretty sure. Now, just give me the... Now, here's the paper. Sign it. Do as you will. I really do. Well, this is a first. What shall I do? Uh, of course. Write your name on the thing. Don't mean to be a stick in the mud, but I'll give the autograph give you the autograph on one condition. A small favor. I want you to visit my twin sister and fetch, fetch a crystal ball from her. She lives in a back alley in Dry Dry Outpost. Her name is Merle. I'm never gonna get the, Mer the Merlin family's names correct. Well, Mario, would you? Yeah. We'll do this next episode. Well, anyway, next time on Paper Mario, we go to Dry Dry Outpost and visit the one person who gives out spells for us in battle to get a crystal ball from her, to go get an autograph, to give it back to the old man, and just for him to give us another coin, and then make for him to um, basically get another cyclist that can give us one coin. That was the mouthful. Anyway, see you all then. My gosh, I wonder what that kid's doing. It's taking him so long to just get one piece of paper signed. I mean, is it really that hard? He must be searching in the desert right now. Eh, I don't know what he's doing. Hmm, what's the next thing I should make him do? Hmm, I know. I should make him go all the way back to the Crystal Palace and just tell him to go cut up a mirror for me so that way I can see my reflection when I'm done with that, you know, exercise book. <laughs> and his reward will be a coin again. And he'll be more mad and mad and mad that he only gets a coin. I'm a genius for thinking like this. Well, kids, see you next time.